Ma Szamira Rafael a vendégem, Szamira a D66 holland pártnak a képviselője, Szamira a parlamentben kereskedelemmel és a nők jogaival foglalkozik leginkább. Hey Samira, thank you very hey. much for being here with me. Yes, go. Yes, thank you. Uh, well, I wanted to ask first of all that how is the situation like over there? Uh, are you getting uh, more and more ill people still or you are uh, entering the recovery curve? Yes, thank you very much um, for, for having me. And, uh, uh, you know, in the Netherlands, uh, it is still a very crucial situation. Um, we recently heard that we are going down in the numbers uh, of people that are now in the intensive care. That is, of course, good news, uh, but still we are dealing also here with the situation that um, that we we need to work with measures uh, that we call an intelligent lockdown. So, for example, yesterday we heard in the press conference of our uh, prime minister that uh, restaurants and bars still need to be closed for the upcoming three weeks. Uh, the schools will be open in May, half of May, uh, but the big events will be cancelled till September. So, and still people are being advised to stay at home as much as possible, to work at home as much as possible. So we are still not in a situation where we can say, um, yes, um, we are going to cancel more and more measures. No, it's, it's still very crucial. And uh, was the economic situation like? Uh... Uh, unfortunately, here in Hungary, unemployment uh, started to climb yes. up. Uh, and I was wondering if you had made any measures in the Netherlands to help people who lost their jobs or who are about to lose their jobs. What kind yes. of policies did you do? Yes, um, we, the, the impact here in the Netherlands is also very, very big because uh, we are a large exporter and you can imagine that this crisis really uh, shocks our economy. And we have large companies um, in the Netherlands that are in big trouble right now. So the government already announced that they will support um, companies, small companies and entrepreneurs. So they have introduced like a large support package. Um, and for example, the business can now uh, receive up to 90% of the salary of a worker that is at home without work. Um, so the main idea is that uh, workers don't get laid off and um, that they still can maintain their businesses, but they need to be supported, yes, on a big scale. There was one more thing I heard about the Netherlands, which like clearly fascinates me. Uh, when the beginning of the crisis broke out, your health minister uh, had to resign. And uh, I heard that uh, your prime minister appointed uh, a person to be health minister who represents the largest opposition party. Uh, is that true or uh, what was the background for this? I, I find it clearly fascinating because here in Hungary, unfortunately, the government clearly refuses to work with the opposition. And uh, I, I think in this situation, we should like rather show unity. And, and for me, this is like a really beautiful example. Can you tell me more about this? Well, it is very good, I think, that the Prime Minister have showed that during this crisis, this is not about political parties, uh, but this is really about what is best for the country. Um, so he indeed appointed a new minister from the Social Democrats in the Netherlands. Um, and I think that was a very good, uh, good example um, of saying that you know during the crisis we are one we need to be united and we just need the best man or the best woman for the job to make sure that we get through the crisis and i think it's a very great example of how the coalition can work with the opposition yes well that, that that's like really really beautiful and uh thanks for sharing that with us well, I, I really hope that we can continue working together to find European solutions also for the crisis, because European cooperation is more important now than ever before. And I am really looking forward uh, to working together with you on that in Parliament in our Renew Europe group. Thank you very much, Samira, for being here with Thank me today. Thank you. I hope to see you soon. Good luck. Bye. Good luck. Keep safe. Bye.